I definitely have not seen this though. Pumpkin Kigurumi? What the heck is that? It's like a one piece pumpkin suit for dudes. <laughs> <laughs> All right, guys, I am in Santa Fe, New Mexico at these fashion outlets, and apparently somewhere among these is a spirit Halloween. This is one of the things that I absolutely love about running around the United States filming these spirit Halloweens, guys, because every place is different. Okay, not maybe not every place, but look at this. There's Tatankas up here, and if you've seen Dances with Wolves, you know what a Tatanka is. Look at this, guys. This is pretty dang crazy in here. I am loving this. Apparently, the Spirit Halloween is like right up here around the corner. But the people I just passed told me that even though there's an open sign on it, it's not open yet. So we're going to find out. Look at this. We got Levi's down here. We have Polo Ralph Lauren over here. We have the Loft Outlet City Fashion. We got a Sunglass Hut here. And look at this, guys. It's right up here. Oh my gosh. I am getting so excited right now. Look at this. This place has the biggest sign out of anything in this whole place. That is absolutely amazing. I guess you'd call this like the courtyard. And yeah, look at this. Like every place has just a basic sized sign on it. This one doesn't even really have a sign, but once you get turned all the way around, you can definitely see the spirit Halloween. What is up with Jack's face though? He's like missing his whole face. And guys, I almost did. What in the world is happening over there? <laughs> Sounds like a trash truck. Anyways, I almost did not stop to film this. I'm on my way to Albuquerque. And I saw that this one was on the way, and I just thought, well, I don't know. Maybe I'll just get where I'm going. But then I went ahead and decided to pull over. And boy, am I glad, because this has got to be one of the most awesome Spirit Halloween stores I've ever seen. Let's go in. On the door, it says they open... What is today? Is today Friday or Saturday? Friday opens at 11, Saturday opens at 10. I don't even know what today is. Okay, so today is Friday. Being out here on the road running around so much, I lose track of what day it is. Today is Friday. We are going in in about five minutes. Okay, the store is officially open, guys. Oh, yeah, this is what I like, walking into the spirit Halloween. All right, guys, so this used to be a Nike outlet store, but now... It's a spirit Halloween. Okay, let's first say hello to poor George because we always do him last. Come on, Georgie. Come on, Georgie. All right, I've heard enough of you. Look at this, guys. Right beside George, they have a hex spawn. Hex spawn is starting to show up in more stores now. And look over here. We have a straw man set up. It's always so funny to me when they set the straw man up in this place right here because he's so tall that he's, like, touching the top of that arch. All right, let's see if we can get him going here. You aren't afraid of little me, are you? Why, I love this time of year. With the dead leaves all around us, and the darkness wraps around us like a mildewing blanket. He sounds like a celebrity, but I cannot think of who he sounds like. <laughs> Alright guys, we got some other animatronics on the floor here we're going to look at in a second, but look at this. We have Gordo! Let's get Gordo going. Okay, come on now. Come on, Gordo. Yeah. He lights up pretty good. Okay, now that I could definitely hear a lot better than what I can usually hear, and it was definitely a secret-keeping cat that just shrieked. And of course we have the widow. <laughs> I don't know why, but people seem to like when I cut it off as soon as she starts screaming. Okay, let's see what they have on the floor for sale. We have a slim right here. Over here, like I already pointed out, we have the hex spawn. We got a whole bunch of things over here, guys. We have a Desmodus here. We have the Mars Attacks Martian Warrior, who I definitely want to pick up one day. We have a Darling Dolly over here, 
who has scared me more than anybody in here this season. Whole stack of jumping spiders here. The Texas Chainsaw Massacre Leatherface. Hello, miss. Over here we have a stilts, aka Papa Pins. I'm undecided whether I want to get Papa Pins or not. I kind of do, but on the other hand, I kind of don't. <laughs> Oh my gosh, I crack myself up, guys. I can see all kinds of awesome stuff over here peeking out, but first, let's go ahead back here. We have a sandworm groundbreaker right here. I saw a guy walking out of a store with that the other day. We have a scary sitting scarecrow on the top. Oh my god, look at this. We have a Lord Farquaad. So many people get mad at me whenever I call Lord Raven Lord Farquaad. But they're just mad because they could never measure up to a great ruler like Lord Farquaad. We have a black heart here. We have an eternal rest here and a stuffed dummy prop we have a life-size posable skeleton over here and look at this guys we have an emmeline over here we have a howling spirit on this end and a bubba man's best friend right over here speaking of the masks let's go over here and just take a look and see if there's anything that we haven't seen and look at this guys we have seen these before but i love this creepy rabbit here look at this hello sir hello wait a minute i don't think i've ever seen this one the burlap bloody goat mask that is pretty creepy right there we have the classic ghost face the classic michael myers and the classic freddy krueger and you gotta love the vintage masks these things are so cool it just takes me back to the day when this is the actual kind of costume that you had to wear hello mr babyhead on a stick this is a smaller store than some of them that i've been in guys but they are totally stocked with just about anything you could need for your halloween costume goodness all right let's come around this way let's see do they have any these plush blankets that I have not seen yet. I think I've seen them all. I, in fact, I bought that one up there. I own this one as well. I own the bouncy Sam head. Here's a whole bunch more there. I really like the Coraline one, although to be honest, I still have not seen Coraline, guys. How crazy is that? They have the Nightcrawler. They have the Mind Flayer. They have Barbara and Adam. Tons of Beetlejuice and Hocus Pocus stuff. They are just absolutely stocked with costumes. They have these guys. They have these guys spewing their bad breath. The Hookhead Hog, the Hook Eye Guy, the Doublehead Fred, and the Ham Hock. We have the Chains of Death. And wait a minute, I see the plush peeking out over here. Yes! Guys, for the first time the other day, I can't even remember. Oh, it was in the store in Colorado that used to be a Gold's Gym that I saw this one for the very first time, the Nightmare Harvester plush. He is so cool. I'm thinking I'm gonna have to buy him today. They also have Crouchy. They also have Skelly. They also have Michael Myers. Who is this? Oh, it's Annabelle. I don't think I've seen that one before either. They have Ghostface. They have a couple of different Sam plushes. Wait a minute. What is this? The Hauntleys? Have you guys seen these? 60 minutes of talking, singing, and joking. I have never seen those before. And it says it includes three characters, a vampire, a zombie, and a skeleton. But beside those, we have a Annabelle, we have two sitting Sam dolls, we have a Chucky Greeter, two Grave Watchers. Oh, I wonder why they have those up there instead of with the other animatronics. We have Eerie Emma, Decrepit Haunted Doll, Loving Lilith, De Devilish Desmond, The Monkey Chimes, Demonic Dolly. Oh my gosh. I can't believe I see this one here right now. This is the first store this season that I've seen this one in, guys. Remember last year, this one was all the rage because there was that viral video of the little girl who carried it with her everywhere? They have sinister spirit dolls, creepy girls on a swing, empty girls on a swing, swinging witches. I always accidentally call the swinging witch the singing witch. Look at this, here's a beanie I haven't seen before. Don't hex my vibe. Wait, have I seen that? I may have seen that in one of the other stores. I don't remember. Remember. I definitely have not seen this though. Pumpkin Kigurumi? What the heck is that? It's like a one piece pumpkin suit for dudes. <laughs> All kinds of Michael Myers stuff, all kinds of ghost face stuff, including the chrome mask and the scream six mask and the devil face. 
all the Chucky stuff. Look at this, they are way stocked on t-shirts right here, guys. I so wish they would bump up the sizes, though. The biggest size is XXL, and they were like a four or five X, because I'm a big fat guy. But if they did have my size, I would be buying a few of these shirts today. One of them would be that Sam shirt right there in the Spirit logo. Another would be the Ghostface Movie Club up there. That is a totally awesome shirt. And I love this one. Never accept a ride from strangers. It's a witch on a broom taking away the children. And look at the look on the cat's face. That is absolutely hilarious. Okay, we looked at a lot of the adult costumes the other day. Let's make our way around to the kids' costumes because I know you guys want to see some of the Five Nights at Freddy's costumes. And here they are. We have Freddy right here, jumpsuit, vest, gloves, and mask. We have the glam rock Freddy, jumpsuit with shoe covers, vest with shoulder pieces, gloves, and mask. Montgomery gator jumpsuit with shoe covers. Covers, vest and shoulder pieces, Roxanne Wolf here with a jumpsuit. And then we have a Foxy on the bottom here, includes jumpsuit, vest, hook, glove, and mask. They have a Huggy Wuggy and Kissy Missy. And look at this, this is like a Huggy Wuggy backpack. Minions, Scooby-Doo, Zelda, Transformers, Gremlins, Monsters, Inc. with one eye. The Incredibles, Toy Story, The Grinch. Oh my gosh, this one is awesome. It's Big Hero 6 Baymax inflatable costume. No way. They even have a Lord Farquaad costume. Here's some Minecraft. They have Steve, Netherite armor, The Creeper, The Minecraft, what? Rammer, what is that? Inflatable Squidward, they have the Doodle Bob. Let's see, we have the Inflatable Patrick. Do we have, yes, we have the Inflatable SpongeBob, as well as the Krusty Krab Jacket if you want to deliver a pizza. Of course, they have Chucky and Clowns and Sam and Skeletons and Ghostface and Sonic over here. Look at this. We have Sonic, we have Tails, Shadow on the top there. Ooh, we got all kinds of Pokemon costumes in this section here. Lots of Super Marios over here. And a whole bunch of the Fall Guys over here, including this guy right here. It's a Fall Guys plush. It's a backpack. It's a Fall Guys backpack. Ninja Turtles on the end here. Oh my gosh, guys. Around every crack and crevice and corner, there are more and more costumes. Nightmare Before Christmas. Hocus Pocus. They have some Beetlejuice and Ghostbusters. All kinds of Monster High and Zombie Nurses and Cheerleaders. Draculaura. And of course they get smaller and smaller till we get to the toddlers. Look at this. They have a toddler, Donald Duck, and Minnie Mouse, and a Goofy here. They even have a toddler Skelly Bones costume. That is awesome. Lots of Bluey costumes here, and Toy Story over there. Nightmare Before Christmas. Look at this. It's a mini Oogie Boogie here. Blue's Clues, SpongeBob, Scooby-Doo, Monsters, Inc., Sully, and Mike Wazowski with one eye. Stitch, Thomas the Train, Minions, Doc McStuffins. Guys, they are absolutely stocked in here and they have just about any costume you want. And look at these giant mirrors here as I walk by. It's kind of creepy. Okay, let's go on back up to the front of the store here, guys. We're going to go into this section that we have not looked at yet. Oh my gosh, they have so much stuff over here. Look at this. We have pumpkin stacks and skeleton stacks. We have these pumpkin skele pumpkins. We have sitting Sam's and Annabelle's. We have Chucky's. I do not see any Glenn's, though. Pajamas, dog costumes, bobbleheads. They have the Pennywise statue, Frankenstein sidestepper, Sam sidestepper, Billy Butcher's sidestepper. Oh, they have the creeping cats. They have the secret keeping cats. They have carrot and they have scabs. Oh, hello, rat. Lots of awesome inflatables. And look at this. Here's another one of these things, the Hauntleys. I've just never heard of that. How cool is that? We have a whole plethora of zombie babies over here. In fact, let's go down this aisle here because look who else they have. Ghostface Horror Babies. Sam Horror Babies. All right, guys, that brings us back around to this Nightmare Harvester right here. I definitely have to buy him. He is totally awesome. And look at his little pumpkin. Guys, look at this. I missed these. Behind the counter, we have a young Crouchy. We have a poor George. A little Skelly Bones. A Betty Sharp. What the heck? We have a Betty Sharp. A little Jack Carver. And a Dagger Mike. Ha <laughs> ha! 
<laughs> All right, guys, I got the Nightmare Harvester. That was awesome. I love this store right here so much. Look how cool that looks. One more look at it before we go, guys. This is one of my favorite stores that I've been in. It looks so awesome, and everybody in there was so nice.